Hey everyone, welcome to Tech Solutions. New at our channel? Please subscribe to be a part of us. Let's unroll the reel. In this Linux tutorial you will be learning how you can install graphical user interface for Kali Linux on WSL2 Windows 10 using WinKex. WinKex provides a Kali desktop experience for Windows subsystem for Linux. So let's figure it how we can that. Open your installed Kali Linux virtual machine on your Windows 10. First update your apt sources. Use the sudo apt update for that. Done updating? Use sudo apt install command to install WinKex for your Kali Linux on WSL2. The download size is large and may take some minutes to download the required packages for WinKex. So have patience and let it all the required packages calmly. It's about to finish the download. All the packages are downloaded successfully. Now wait a little more to install them. This may finish within a minute or two. Installation of WinKex is finished successfully. Now we have three modes of WinKex to try and view. All of these support sound as well. Let's start WinKex in Windows mode with sound support. Enter the shown command on your screen. Enter your password you chosen when you installed Kali Linux on WSL2. Welcome to Kali Linux Graphical User Interface on WSL2. It's a full functional Kali desktop. Let's log off and try the enhanced session mode. Enter the shown command. Allow the remote desktop connection permissions. In this mode, Kali Linux is being displayed as a remote computer. It is also a full functional Kali desktop. Log off again to see the seamless mode. Enter the shown command to enter Kali Linux seamless mode on your Windows 10. This may take couple of seconds to start fully. Hooray! Kali and Windows 10 sharing the same desktop. Kali on the upper part of screen and Windows on the lower. Enjoy using both of them at same time seamlessly. Enjoy fully functional Kali Linux desktop. All thanks to WSL2 on Windows 10. Hope you liked the tutorial. Anything to ask? Comment it. Thanks for watching. Good day.